Fam, what's happening? It's your favorite auntie with Uncle Tendencies. I'm back. Can somebody say uh, Audie Crooks? Can somebody say Audie Crooks? Oh, my gosh. Okay, freshman, show out then. Somebody say Audie Crooks. 40 on the 20-point comeback? Let's go. If y'all not talking about these freshmen, I don't know what y'all talking about. There's a lot of stories people talking about, but, hey, these freshmen showing out. 40 points? Let me get in this chat because I know Bree Wayne got to be talking about Audie Crooks. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. What's happening, y'all? Audie Crooks, 40 points. Okay, let's go. Okay, Robert, I just seen it. I, Bree Wayne, did you hear me call your name? Did you hear me call your name, Bree Wayne? I said I couldn't get on. I couldn't get on here fast enough. Okay, she's her. I, I'm working on the video. I'm working on the video, Bree Wayne, for sure. Okay, you picked them to beat Maryland. All right. Uh, they had me frustrated at halftime. They were down bad. Hey, you ain't got to worry if all these. Hey, I, I don't know what you drive, but all these all right. You hear me? You hear me? Uh, all these is all right to me. Uh, let's see. They hit them threes and went inside. To, listen, Maryland had no answer. They didn't. <laughs> they had no answer for that Audi. You hear me? Okay, Norfolk State versus uh versus Stanford. What, what's the score there? Another thing about Iowa State girls, they shoot 90% on free throws. Yeah, very good with the uh with the fundamentals for sure. What else we got going on here? Stanford is always on upset alert. Yeah. Yeah, they do. Okay. Yeah, I agree, but I think they'll beat Norfolk State. Okay. Yeah, they at home. Hopefully they take care of business. They better. Yeah, you're right. Oh, Miss beat them in their own house. They will get beat at the crib now. Ask, ask Juju about it. Yeah, some they should not exactly. Uh, do you remember Diamond Johnson? She used to be the point guard in North Carolina State. Now she with Norfolk State. Oh, is that who's showing out? Okay. Okay. Audie Crooks in one of my vi Audie Crooks is getting a video. She getting a video. <laughs> Listen, getting a video. Freshman, 40 points, 20 point comeback in the tourney, round one, first time here. Yeah, you get one. Hey, uh, Antonio, I'm back. Let's go. We watching hoops. I'm talking hoops. Let's go. Uh, why did she transfer to HBCU? Mm, okay, we don't know why. Okay. Some work early. Okay, 12 15. Yeah, still lost. Because of Audie, Audie Crooks, ask him, ask him about her. Okay, Stanford leading. Okay. Yep, Diamond Johnson. Okay. What's up, y'all? I was over here watching the last live cracking up. What's up, the nice backyard? What's happening, backyard garden? What's good? Audie Crooks, y'all. Audie Crooks. Yeah, Audie Crooks is definitely going to get a, <clears throat> a body name, Audie. Oh, listen. Hey, RC, hey, shout out, man. I'm, I'm sorry that I missed the live. Why you didn't tell us you was going live afterwards? You could have put that in the chat so we would have been looking for it. Sneaky, 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 RC. Come on. Sneaky. But I snuck on there and watched you. <coughs> oh, no. Nah. What's, what's the score, y'all? Somebody give me that Stanford score. 40 points on 90% shooting. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah. Oh, oh, LL. We was here for it all together. It was, mm. yeah, they didn't look like the LSU I know. That's for sure. They didn't look like the LSU I know. So I'm, I'm, uh, I'm really interested to see how they bounce back. I'm, I'm inter interested to see how they bounce back. 40 points on 90. Okay. Yeah, RC, you is sneaky. You could have told us that. You could have told, hey, y'all, I'm going to do a rundown on the, on the day, uh, live on my channel in, in, a, in a little bit. No, you act like you was going for the day. See us later. Then you, I, I look up and it's like, oh, Hawkeye's guy was live. Come on now. Uh, did them crooked. Do you hear me? Did them bad. I'm not even going to lie. Audie Crooks is better than Camilla, just less mobile. Really? Okay. Okay. Buddy Roll. I'm 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 trying I'm just trying to have some fun here. I'm just trying to have some fun with the fam. What's good, y'all? What is good? Twenty to twelve, Stanford. Okay, okay, they look like they're gonna ha take care of business. Norfolk not getting the fouls called, and they getting banged up. Twelve twenty, Stanford. Okay, so it could be a little closer. Okay, you seeing some calls not going in? All right. Muslim was pissed. Iowa State won. LOL messes bracket up. He was like, "Hey, look at this big girl." Boy, stop. I told you to pick them due to her alone. <laughs> okay. If we didn't listen to Bree Wayne, Bree Wayne said Iowa State, let's go. The freshmen ain't got nothing to lose. 
Okay, Stanford rolling now. Okay, I figured they get rolling because I I clicked it on for a minute. It looked like uh somebody had blocked uh Cameron Brink at the at, at the hoop, so I figured they would get it together. So I said, Audie, turn up. We bought that ain't what they said. That, that ain't what she said. That ain't what they said. They said, Audie, do your thing. Audie, we ain't we, we ain't going home. We ain't ready to go home yet. That's what they told Audie. Audie said, what? We still in the tourney. Let's go. See you Sunday. Iowa State versus Maryland was, oh, listen. I, I'm, I'm, I'm going to have to go back and watch the whole thing. I'm, I'm going to be up all night watching basketball. I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know how. I don't know how. I don't know how. Uh. Because because the, the timidness that I see with Del Rosario, and maybe Del Rosario just feels uh pressure because she's at she's at LSU and they defended champs and all of that. Maybe, maybe she's putting a little bit more on herself than she got to. Maybe that's it. But uh Audie, listen. Okay, uh, listen. There you go, AIO, right there. Audie Crooks went crazy. Didn't she crazy? Out of her mind. Let's go. Uh, RC, yeah, RC is your channel. It's 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 a uh, it's Hawkeye's guy. It's his name. Juju looks good on her AT and T commercial. So glad she's getting her recognition. Yes, Juju has some great commercials come out uh, too. What did she sign with Nerd Wallet too? Is that Juju got the Nerd Wallet deal? She put her team on her back. She said, "Let's go get, let's go, y'all." No, he wrong and, and right at the same damn time. <laughs> same name, RC. Your Aces and Hawkeye's guy. Yes. Maryland don't just have no big size to go against Crooks. It ain't a lot. It ain't a lot of teams. Ain't a lot of teams. Robert got no big size to go against Crooks. Uh, Crooks gonna be a problem. Crooks gonna be a problem next few years. You better you gonna, you better have a big to deal with her. Also, another post player, Cody S. Listen, Cody S. Has showed out. Cody S. Has showed out. I was watching you comment uh, in the chat. I didn't. I haven't seen any highlights of what Cody did, but I'm going. I'm definitely going to look. Rank Lord and then Rosario too scored 21 points today. But uh, listen. Uh, Audie Crooks, the biggest biggest story right now. The biggest story right. Oh, see what Texas saying they're gonna do. Okay, we got the tip off. Okay, I got you. Not looking good for A uh, and T. One of their stars hurt. Oh my goodness. She put put the whole university on her back. She said, "Let's go, y'all." What's goody, Mike Jink? What's goody? What's goody? We we checking it out. Uh, barely, hey Rice. Rice plays some good basketball. Rice plays some good basketball. I can't, I can't say that young lady uh name very well. But number thirty five, that, that's a junior. I'm, 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 I'm a watch for her. I'm a watch for her. Uh, she played against Angel pretty good. She kept, she kept Angel frustrated. I don't know what else she got in her game. This is the first time I've seen her, but she at least did her job today. A and L got you. I thought Maryland was gonna win. My bracket hanging on by a thread. Most of them anyway. And my, my bracket then fell apart. I'm just here so I don't get fined, RC, for real. Uh, so who Iowa State got to play? Yeah, who do, who is Iowa State playing? Uh, she been like that. She cooked Ioka Lee, a 6'6 senior post player. Okay. Texas beat them in the Big 12 championship. Show sure did. Shaquille O'Audi. Uh-oh. RC with, coming with some nicknames. <clears throat> Nebraska up full zip. Hey, we ain't going to see that Louisville LSU game. Yeah, Mike Jink, that one ain't going to happen. They did not want to see HBL. Uh, LSU with the struggle win. Kim, hot, hot mad. Piping hot mad, okay? Not going to lie, I was joking Rice real bad until I seen them play. Hey, LL, LL they ended up being better than we thought. They came, they came prepared. They came at least to, uh, to, to give it a, a real try. Uh oh, four likes. Hit it, y'all. We got 28 in the chat. Run them likes up for me, y'all. I think Iowa State playing Stanford. Oh, yeah. Okay. Listen, they're going to have to deal with Audi. 1224 Stanford. Okay. Hey, y'all did. Y'all hear what? No. R RC, what did she say? I ain't seen the pressure yet. Clippers, Cookie, the Trailblazers. Asked about the Louisville game. She said, I don't care about that. It's not my business. <laughs> I heard that. Okay, spoiled brat. Thank you for letting me know. I think Iowa State will play the winner of Stanford and Norfolk. Yeah, they probably will. Do all you got one more game in her? What y'all think? Could they beat a Cinderella? Oh. 
Oh, yeah. If you wasn't familiar with his game, oh, yeah. He's something else. Oh, come on, Texas A&M. I mean, what are y'all? Come on. Who's who's showing up for this, this game? It ain't her business. Is Texas ain't even gonna show up at all? Okay, six nothing on my on my TV. She said middle team was middle, middle Tennessee was gonna beat their ass <laughs> during selection Sunday. Uh oh, okay. So she had predicted. I wish I'd have heard her. Plus Haley, hurry up and deflected that comment. She said it was spoiled. Brad said and was like, next question. <laughs> not even not next question. Okay, HBL. I, I need Texas A&M to score first. They ain't scored on my TV yet. I can't say. This game against Norfolk might get sad because even my local team, Minnesota, did well against them, and they had a horrible season. Oh, oh. Sam, you just shot down all my hopes. Okay, you'll pick Stanford to be Iowa State. I I, I, I mean, I, I think that that would, be the, that would be the logical choice, right? The logical choice would be, Stanford, you you would pick them, but the logical choice probably was Maryland too today. But Artie Crooks has something else to say about it, so I'm just, I want to see how I just want to see what else the freshman got to say. Because to go get forty in the first game of your first uh, tourney and just put your team on the back like that and come back from twenty down, shoot ninety percent, uh, she might have she might have something to say a couple rounds in, into this here thing. Nebraska, Nebraska about to shoot them out the gym. Okay, yeah, it looked like it. Number 40 for Nebraska, Alexa Mark Whiskey. Markowski? I don't know how to say that. Y'all know. A beast with it. Okay, Alexis, number 40. I'm keeping an eye. Oh, look at me here. Knock this stuff over, y'all. Yeah. Sure. Still knock this stuff over. I don't think that don't want to be right there. Texas A&M, LSU, Denardi embarrassed the SEC for today. Get it together. Might be down another one when one of their players is out. Yeah, they might. They just they might not have an answer. What's a video short on ESPN YouTube channel? Just messy. Uh oh. Haley love her, but she be talking greasy. <laughs> she has seven, not twenty-seven. Okay, RC. Okay, with, with, you know, because Angel said, how many points you got? Okay, then. <laughs> it's one of my favorite lines of the season. That's one of my favorite lines. I got Nebraska winning if they shoot well from three. You know, they ain't going to have to shoot well from three. Texas a him ain't shooting at all. All they got to do is just keep the ball away from Texas the rest of the game. Look like. Cam Brinks wants zero smoke against Audi. Oh, she don't want no smoke. Cameron Brink, though, I don't think she want no smoke against Audi. So I have to figure out something else for Audi. I don't think it'll be Cameron Brink. No fouls being called at all. They 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 not gonna get no calls. We know that all about Jazz. Uh, if the wrong Texas A&M team show up, and the right Nebraska team do, that's exactly what's gonna happen. Uh, yeah, it's going. It's, it look like it's going that way right now. AIO, that girl who played in Kitley spot for VT was eating. Okay, uh, who who was that, y'all? Who who was that? What's, what's what's her name? I want to I want to check her out. They don't have enough offense to beat Nebraska. They don't. They don't look like they got enough anything right now. Antonio, uh, I don't know. Maybe they just nervous a little tight. Let's see how they. Let's see what the, what the second quarter look like. Maybe Kiki is real good at the center spot for Stanford. Okay, so you like you like Kiki against uh against Audi. You think she she got uh she got that work for Audi? Okay, it's a good call out. HBO talking all that mess with five turnovers. <laughs> Bree Wayne, you don't miss uh, you. Bree Wayne, you be right there with the stats. I can count on you. LSU offense was not good today, but Big Four was hitting them shots. Look like Big Four hit them shots. Somebody else uh, looked like they played pretty good for them. Uh, Moro played pretty good for them. And Michaela, I think uh, I think uh, Big Four and Michaela both had fourteen or something. And uh, maybe Morrow had 15, something like that. Correct me in the chat if I'm wrong, y'all. Thought she was done for the night, too. I didn't plan that live either. Sometimes I do them randomly. I'm just saying, uh, RC, I, I was here, and, and the fam said, come back. We were we were doing this together as a family, and so I said I would be here. That's how I, that's how it wasn't on the, it wasn't on the calendar. 
But when the fam said come back, I had to come on back. And now and then I said I'll be here tomorrow for one o'clock for Jackson State UConn RC. HBO 7.5 turnovers, but be talking. It was not a good game for HBO at all. Uh you said Joni Taylor looks stressed. <laughs> uh I, I smile. I don't think that this isn't the same Texas AM team that showed up to play us. No, not so far. You know, ever case y'all next opponent. I was watching LSU today looking for weaknesses and did the same thing with Holy Cross versus Tennessee Martin. Mm, not 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 so no, I didn't I didn't uh RC, I didn't I didn't I didn't feel a reason to uh to to case the blue holes. I didn't uh I didn't I didn't see a reason to uh to uh to case them out. No. Mm-mm. Um maybe deeper into the tournament, but the blue holes, no. I was I was pretty confident about them. I was I was okay with us, even even with no Camilla. Now no Bree Hall kind of surprised me. That one kind of surprised me. And I'm I'm a little concerned about Bree Hall because North Carolina guards is like six foot six one. So that's more like a, a Johnson Johnson kind of back. Uh, backcourt back there, or or uh, a Johnson. I'm sorry, a Johnson Bree Hall, a, a, a Hall Johnson kind of backcourt. Tessa, so Tessa looked a little nervous today. I hope that she settled down because uh, I think this is her uh, this is her stage to, to to show out. I think Tessa can really get going and get hot uh, from three. So I want to see her have a good tournament. So I, I want to see her uh, get heated up against North Carolina. But I would I would love to see her be able to play and defend uh, against those guards tomorrow. Tennessee play at 12, do they? Oh, I might have to come on for Rakia. Tennessee on at 12, might have to look at that. Uh, or or we were just bad that day. Hmm, could have been. This is why I be talking about, about the play big teams hard, and now look. What you mean? Oh, they play the big teams, they play against the big teams good, and then don't show up against the other ones, Okay. All Texas needs is to make it a half court game and make it physical. Well, Antonio, they better get it going. The blue who? Did you say the blue hose? No, hose like a like a um like a like a water hose, like a water hose, blue hose, like panty hose. That's their that's their name. I know they feeling blue after that whipping, but they they got to be hose. So, no, that's they RC. That's their name. They are the Presbyterian blue hose. I'm not making this up now. Look it up. We we were talking about this earlier, RC. Where were you? There, I, I didn't. I didn't call nobody no hoes. Look at you putting that on me out here like this. I didn't say that. Hoes like a water hose. Get your mind out the gutter, RC. Where you at? I'm in the past. When I said, "No, I got a blind ten. <laughs> Sorry, yeah, she blind ten straight up. She like pick one. It's not hoes, y'all. Like E S hoes S E like hoes water hoes. What are y'all? Y'all so funny. Norfolk State. It's me a punch in the mouth. That's horrible. I wonder what is really wrong, wrong with Bree Hall. Uh, so what I saw Dawn say was that it was like it was weird. It was like, we'll see how she feels tomorrow, but she's fine. So I, I didn't know what to take from that. Um, the girl who was playing for Kitley was Clara Strack. 17 and 5, four blocks. Damn. Yeah, she ate. Okay. I got to go look her up. Okay, okay, we're keeping our eyes on Tennessee. Okay, we're keeping our eyes on Tennessee. Are we pulling all nighter? I mean, I'm here for it. I'm here for it. Basketball is on. I'm on. Let's do it. I'm not scared. Uh, get up in time for the Connecticut versus Morgan State game. Ain't nobody, Connecticut don't play Morgan State. You're so disrespectful, RC. And you know who that's Jackson State. And I'm going to be up. Okay, typo. You was trying to be funny. I'm up for it. Don't do that. Sleepers for suckers. Let's go. Y'all know what it is. Someone said Bree Knee was sore. Oh. Well, that's not good. That was that must happen in, in in practice. I didn't I don't remember Bree being hurt uh during the tourney. So we're keeping our eyes on Tennessee. RC, when is your next live? Yeah, I'm ready to see the JSU game too. UConn better win. I think it's a good chance that they'll win because they playing at the crib and everything. But Jackson State got some height on them. And they could get athletic and physical with a beat up, with a banged up UConn team that that it, it could go either way. Let's see here. No. My lady don't need to start. 
Don't do that. RC, she love it. I love it. She don't need to start. My lady came out there and she dropped like what? 17 points in 21 minutes today? Something like that? 17 points in 22 minutes? She's fine. She's fine. We don't we don't need her to start. But what I think is that this is gonna be like a a bounce back game for her from the benching game. So I expect my lady to show up. But I I think Tessa Johnson gonna go off. Tessa with the J. I'm I'm, I'm with it. Uh let's see. I'm skipping stuff. Uh, Tracy Brown, I'm here for it. I'm here for it. We, we fam, let's do it. Uh, we ain't getting no sleep during the turn. Nope, no sleep. I normally go live after Iowa games. At least I've been going live after the past couple games. Okay, okay, I'll be looking for you. We need Jenna. She's 6'5". They got her practicing, but she can't play hard. Mm. What? Uh, what's what's going on with her? Uh, what's going on with her? Why she can't? Why she can't play hard? What's going on? Did you see when Chloe said she don't care about starting? No, I didn't see that. But Chloe was a, was the story of this game. Chloe Chloe Kitts was the story of this game. <clears throat> Maybe she don't need to start. Maybe she don't need to start. But Chloe got off. What she had twenty one to thirteen. She got she got down. Okay. But I do wonder why she isn't starting. Me too. But Fagan got down too though. SC fans need to exercise a little faith in the team. They have proven they can win no matter who's in the lineup. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, Doc Glover. I think uh, you know what I, I think we just spoiled. I think we just spoiled. We want a hundred points every game. We want to blow everybody out. We want to be undefeated every season. We Don spoiled us. That is it's, it's her fault. But we know we try to we trying to act better. We trying to act better, Doc Glover. We know that sometimes you gotta win by three. And that's and that's still a good game. But we be looking at it like, mm, they got within seven. This was horrible. So we we we'll do better. Our lineup, I think. And even uh even Sakima. Sakima had five today. She had a steal. Uh what was she like 50% from the floor? 100 percent from free throw? Something like that. But I'm looking for a routine. Okay. We we gotta get you on the schedule, RC. Because what you gonna do when Iowa quit playing? Then who you gonna go live after? You gotta talk to me about that. Let's talk about it. Nebraska bricking. Don't let uh Rogers get hot. Uh Okay, 12-11, 12-11 on my TV, 2-19 two, 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 left in the first. Lay study the team before she gets on the floor. I love it. She part of Don Spade's hand. Listen, she might be the big joker. Might be the big joker. I don't know. I'm trying to figure it out who the ace is, little joker, big joker like that. She might be the big joker, though. I'm just, I don't know. Y'all let me know. Doc Glover, don't let this Presbyterian win get you high. Uh, Rewind. Rewind. We're... Listen, where you got your brown paper bag next to you because you be hyperventilating and all that. We we all right, Brie Wayne. Come on. Kevin Will say he likes Chloe come off the bench uh, the way she played today. Okay. Okay. Uh, listen, I think that they are uh, going to end up being like kind of like the Warriors in a way where they may mix it up. You know how Steve Kerr mix it up a little bit if y'all watch them? Uh, it, it'll be dependent upon who they're playing. In the matchups, I think more so than it'll be you. You're a forever starter, and I think that's a fair way to look at it, especially with all the talent she's got coming in there. To just be able to say it's going to come down to who who is busting their ass in practice, and what the and what the matchups are for the teams that we coming into. Because, I mean, once these other three, once these other three young ladies get going, Maddie is healthy, Adele is there, Joyce is there, whoever's coming back is here. It's gonna be it's gonna be so many. Look, blind ten, y'all. Don is going to be out here running a blind 10, straight up. Period. Lay do her homework. Yes. Uh, Chloe Buckets, absolutely. Oh, Fagan, Fagan coming along. I, I, I'm loving the way she's finishing up this season. Yeah, Texas is heating up, it looked like, too. She's so skilled offensively. Who is that, Fagan? Texas heating up. Texas? Okay. Sess then UCLA? Uh, UCLA what? Tell me. Yeah, and I smile. Is she Brie Wayne? I love tonight, Fagan too. Yeah. She's really coming on at the end of this season. Since uh uh I think Fagan's been coming on, y'all, probably since Cardoso uh went to Brazil. She went to, since since Cardoso went to Brazil, probably. Jenny got oh. Oh damn. Yeah, Achilles. Yeah, that's horrible. Dang. Uh I I hate the I hate when the when the injuries keep the kids out the out the tournament. Did you see Audie had a 40 P Donovan? I can't, I, I gotta, I gotta do it. I'm gonna have to do a story on Audie about that. Okay. 
Freshman, 40, first round of the tourney, first time she'd been here. Brought him back from 20. Nobody thought so. Uh, Iowa State, let's go. They might be the Cinderella. 9-10 on your TV. It's tied up on my TV, y'all. 12-12, minute 34. Tell, tell me what's on y'all TV. Barker already doing too small. Oh, goodness. It's going to be over quick. Chloe hitting that midi. Hard to stop us. Yeah, that me, her midi game, crazy. Says the men's Nebraska team also played the men's Texas A&M team today, too. Who won that one, RC? If we beat UNC by 80 points Sunday, I'll get high. What? Free win? Okay, I'll take two shots. Let's, let's it's a bet. It's a bet. <laughs> it's a bet. That's a bet right there. It can't be no Reggie. You got to roll up some real medicine. A AIO, right? Then she comes in and picks their pockets. <laughs> If we score 80 on, on USC, run it up. We're going to drop 100 on them. Uh, she's something special. Definitely, definitely. Uh, genius. Basketball mind out of this world. Not even just a basketball mind. Phenomenal person, I think. That's what I smile. Okay. everybody. Did everybody have any medicine while they was up? Because I had mine. So I'm ready. I'm locked in. 14 12. I'm here. Uh, if Nebraska get blown out today, we know Iowa is pretty bad. Ooh, okay. Wow. Okay. Yeah, that mm, what does that say about Iowa? Oh no. Somebody else got hurt. Reagan Beers got hurt. Somebody talked to me. Bree Wayne, do not be scared of Oregon State. They big and slow. Run. 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 We coming with the we coming. We going four guards, Bree Wayne. On that. Oh, on that noise, fam. <laughs> oh goodness. 11 12 now on your TV. Okay, 14 12 Nebraska for me. I think I'm a, I'm a, I'm a little ahead of y'all. Mm. Just mm, like that? Okay. Right. I'd be like, oh, she's stealing. <laughs> what? Watkins don't seem to be the same. No, she does not. But I expect a breakout game for Watkins. I'm predicting a breakout game for Watkins uh, Sunday. And. Cardoso to go off. Uh, them two, I want everybody to go off. But Watkins and Cardoso had the little, 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 little scuffle or whatever that was the last North Carolina game. So I expect them, right, y'all? Tell me if I'm wrong. So I expect them to want to want to have kind of like a bounce back game. Then Malaysia got benched that game. I think she only played like three minutes. So North Carolina don't even really know what what we look like when Malaysia's in the game. So it, it's gonna be it's gonna be a fun one. It's a, it's everybody could go off. I I hope everybody goes off. Let's blow them out the water. I couldn't believe the score when I looked at it. Uh, oh, the Maryland and uh, Iowa State game. I couldn't – when I saw Audi Crooks 40 back from 20, that's what flashed on my phone first. I said, oh, look, I got to cut this. I got to change the channel. Oh, no, Sam. No. Oh, that's why they call it weight. That's why they call it weight. Uh, just looking at our roster and their ability to play and to step up. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. Doc Glover say, no, I'm sober. I'm here. Mm-mm. We, we just got a great roster. Okay. She did have an ankle injury. Now, is it like tournament end, ending? What, what we got? They said Maryland ain't been the same since they left stores. Oh. Okay. So UConn took they, took they, uh, took they cornbread. Okay. Morgan State bigs be shooting, but they are slow. Yeah, they like to keep up with us. Run, 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 run. Like Forrest. Run. Forrest, run. Let's go. Crockpot's out. Let's go. I didn't see the video, so I don't know how it happened. Hope she's okay, though. Yes, definitely hoping that she's okay. If Audie gets into actual true playing shape, she actually might need to drop weight if she's going to play like this. Uh, I think that um, if she stays dedicated just, just by continuously playing, for sure she's going to play into a, a college shape. Um. I don't, you know, I, I don't know because of her size. I don't know how much uh, smaller she would get. She's just, I mean, she's a, she's just a tall, big girl, period. I don't know that I feel like she's really, I mean, way, way, way out of shape. She dropped 40 on, on some co on some D1 college players today. Can she be in better shape? Absolutely. Do I think she'll get in better shape? Yes. If they know, if they know what I know and they saw what I saw today, they will want her to stay this summer. They will be trying to have her have a nutritionist and they will be trying to have her Get in the best shape she can. I don't know if that means really a lot smaller, 
but definitely some better shape, I think. But if she does, she's going to be a problem. I did not see a game time for Sunday. Does anybody have a game time for Sunday yet? Who do I think is going to start the next SC game? The regular starters. I think she starts the regular starters. Uh, just because Car- Cardoso's back. Um, and I think Kitts may even be back in the, in the starting lineup there. I just like the Kitts-Cardoso combination when they're on the floor. Uh, I think they play well together. Uh, Kansas State or Colorado? RC is hard to say because it depends on which team shows up. Colorado can be really, really good. Um, and then they could be really, really bad. I haven't watched a lot of Kansas State, but um, they have. They didn't really blow me out the water when I saw them. So uh, hard to say. It would be a, a toss up. Um, I probably would just go Colorado because just because I've seen them more, um, and I, I I know I, I know what they're kind of capable of. But y'all tell me in the chat what y'all think. They, I don't know. Yeah, they're not ready for late for real, for real. Not the, especially not that she's she's not. Uh, her defense is way different. Her defense is way different. So, um, I don't know. And do y'all, do y'all think we see like lay on on Deja Kelly? Who do y'all expect us to 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 come with Deja Kelly on? I mean, on Deja Kelly, SC by twenty on NC. Okay, Doc Glover. Okay, I'm I'm liking it. Oh, it'll be a, it'll be a happy day for me. Watkins and Lay are good coming off the bench because they sit there together and study and talk about what they're gonna do. I'll be watching, watching. Yeah, they do. They do have a, a a real chemistry, and it seemed like Fagan be in on that a little bit too. Uh, but those two, they really have a good chemistry. But they've been playing together for a long time. Uh, and I like that. I saw that those young ladies did that. Uh, that uh that, that basketball camp together. I thought that was really cool that uh Ashlyn did that that uh that basketball camp uh for her home in her hometown, saying that she was uh basically kind of like inspired by Dawn and everything that she does. So I thought that was pretty cool. They're not ready for this Malaysia. No, this is a different Malaysia. This this like like they got uh game six clay, this like tournament lay. Tournament lay, different. Tourney lay. Different, straight, different. Lay with the butter, different. They not ready. Uh, Malaysia, uh, we're hitting some big threes today. Yeah, she did. I, she came. Was she at four in the in the first half? And so this is a this is and this is a question I have about that. This is a good. That's a good point. Uh, bring Audi Crooks to Molly Molly Benetti. Body by Molly is something serious. And I wonder, like, in the offseason, can some of these players do they allow? Can Molly train some some players outside of SC? Does anybody know? Can you come just be like, hey, I need to get a body by Molly and work out with Molly for the summer? I mean, of course, pay her, but is she available like that? Anybody know? Um, her confidence is through the roof right now. Her confidence is through the roof. Look, she was just the most valuable player of the entire SEC tournament. And they won it, and she was on the floor to help finish it. Her confidence off the roof. They're not gonna be able to put her back in the box now. It's over with. This is this was it. They held her back long as they could. Dawn brought her along as slow as she could to make sure that she had both sides of the ball down. And now it's over. They not you can't put Lay back in the box now. No, especially not with all these not, not with all these NIL deals and all these eyes on her now. Hell no, she can't go back in the box. And I wouldn't want to put her back in the box. Ooh. Everybody better watch out. Like I said, it's going to be some good battles coming up. It's going to be some good battles coming up. It's going to be some good battles coming up with these freshmen. Courtney Paris played with similar size to Oklahoma. She was a beast. Yeah, country notary. So, I, you know, sometimes that's just your size. Like Peely, I don't know that there's a different size that she plays in, but that's her that's her playing size. It works for her. It, it may it may it may wear on the knees over time. I could see that wearing her knees out over time a little bit quicker than if she was smaller. Um, same thing with Audie Crooks. Uh, maybe and then you know susceptible to some injuries if they don't get in some better shape. But uh, sometimes you just sometimes you're just a big girl. Okay, you think you think Fagan's gonna, gonna start over Chloe now? I, I'm okay with that. I'm okay. Yeah, I don't care who start because everybody gonna play. That's what it seemed like to me. It don't, it don't matter. It, it don't matter who start. Everybody gonna play, and it looked like everybody get at least about 15 minutes or so at least, and then some maybe get 26, 30, something like that. But Seemed pretty with the except. Well, even even Walker had like 16 minutes or so today, I think. Anybody know why Lauren Ware is not playing? Hey, yeah, Alyssa did. 
Uh, she had she had a good game against us. I was looking at that. Uh, I think we'll keep her off the boards. I think I think we'll we'll keep her off the boards. Okay, breezy on Kelly. Okay, she's not a threat to us. Okay, and I I, I was thinking breezy or Tessa. Tessa seemed a little bit timid today, like she was still kind of getting her turning legs together. But I think she'll be she'll be okay for the for the next round. And uh, I'm I'm just hoping everything's okay with Bree Hall. I don't uh, you know I definitely don't want no knee injuries for the team. Not worried about seeing UNC again. Bring it to me straight up. Worried or not really though. I'm not I'm not worried. I'm I'm not. I just said they can't put my laser back in the box. I'm 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 not worried at all. Bree Wayne, don't you say you worried? We together, Bree Wayne. Remember, we're not headed to no tree. Come on, don't don't say you worried. Yeah, they did a they did a, a, a basketball camp. There's some pictures up. Uh, I think it's some in, at the in my my laser story. I think there's some pictures of them at the Ashland camp doing different drills with some kids. Maybe that's the reason she didn't start because you say Chloe and Cardoso play better together. Today, I just like I said, don't got a blind ten. Is she, is she she sometimes she lead with spades, sometimes she lead with diamonds, clubs. So there. She got blind team. She do whatever she want to do out there, y'all, like a mad scientist. Today it was just like, let me see what they do, I think. Um, and then too, it was uh it was the blue holes, and you didn't want to really just overwhelm them. You, you we had seen them before already, so we kind of knew what it was gonna be. We, we weren't threatened by them at all. So it was like, let's 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 take it easy. Uh I agree, like breezy defense. I live in Columbia. Lay has a camp here in May. It's going to be crazy. Oh, congratulations. Lay, that's what I'm talking about. That's my freshman. That's my freshman. Let's go. Camp in May. Okay. I love that. I love that. I love when they get back, when, that they already are in their communities giving back. I, I, that's, that's so dope. Okay. Still to be, to, be, to be announced on the tickets. Okay. Okay. She sells it on her IG. That's dope. Okay, Molly. Everybody getting money in South Carolina. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, I am Deja Kelly flopping ass, drawing files like crazy. Oh, my goodness. Nebraska, Texas A&M is 19, 14, 19, 16. Close. They let them hang around. Nebraska let Texas A&M hang around here. It, it might be Texas in the end. Deja Kelly, yeah, she be irking me with the flop. She flopped late in it against uh, MSU Tory Osmond. Uh, really? Okay, I thought, I thought, I thought. Folks love Deja Kelly. I ain't watched her too much. What country, country what, I, what I miss about on that part, country notary? Oh, not a threat to us. <laughs> they showed her in a boot. Who? Who who's in the boot? Uh-oh, I missed something spoiled, Brad. Who's in the boot? The big flopper Ruski. Oh, RC. <laughs> You'll see good if they not winning. It's going to be a good, good ass game, though. Okay, LL, you think it's going to be a good game? I think it might be close early, but I expect us to go ahead and, and get that, get, get, uh, get the easy work out the way early. Let's get it done. I'm off of SC and my Texas team, so I hope Baylor knocks off DT. What you think? Uh, uh, all about jazz. I don't know. I haven't seen enough of both of those teams to really be like, have a pick, but for some reason I'm, I'm leaning VT. I'm, I'm leaning VT. I'm leaning VT on that one. They playing better than anybody expected. Two point game, still uh, six thirty in the, in the uh, second. We are watching my laser mature and become great with every day. Absolutely, Nolan. Right, we are watching history in the making. It's crazy to just we're watching history right before our eyes. Three fouls before the half. before the half. Oh well, she's out. Sit down. You pick Texas for the upset on this round. I I picked them on one bracket and not on the other. Where from Texas is in the boot. Oh, okay. Damn. Oh well. Owner, she done. If they, well, they they done anyway because they they don't look like they're gonna get out this game. Did y'all know Janai was number three recruit coming out from high school? No, did not. Bree Wayne, you be having all the facts. 
No Molly Davis tomorrow says something tells me we might still be okay. We might. RC, you just want me to say y'all going to be okay, huh? Y'all all right. Y'all will be okay tomorrow. Win or lose, y'all will be okay. That's what that's, that's, that's what I need you to know. Win or lose, RC. Say it with me. We'll be okay. We'll be okay. We'll be okay. Win or lose. Because you still got UCLA out there. So you'll be okay. Don't worry about it. I don't know what I'm going to do with RC, y'all. He's nervous, right? I think it'll be VT over Baylor, but I would like to see Baylor over VT. Okay. Stanford is up 32-19. It's over. He, yes, RC, please be confident in your team. And RC, there's a reason Nebraska didn't shoot threes today. They'll go to the tree if they don't hit threes. They will be at the tree for sure. It was high on the list. Couldn't remember what number, though. Okay. Late postgame pressures kill me, though. LOL, she be so PC that she don't answer the questions that. <laughs> hey, listen. She got good rep representation. She be like, um, I don't know. Uh, I'm just happy to be here. My teammates are helping me. I'm just blessed, happy, everything. Yep, so blessed. Everybody's throwing me the ball. We just win. So blessed, everything. Like that. Be like, what you say, Lay? They asked you, how did you feel about the uh, the girl guarding you? Just so blessed, happy to be here. Yep. Just like Barry Bonds, when they kept asking him about if he took steroids. Uh, he's only answering questions about home runs. Lay ain't messing up. No money. I smile. I would probably say Ashlyn because I've seen more of her. But y'all tell me I'm not I'm not the best one to answer that question. Oh, here go the threes. Oh, both of them got a bad temper. Okay. Encouraging Bree Wayne and RC for me. LOL. I love it. <laughs> I'm here for y'all. We fam. Watkins. Okay. You said Watkins. Okay. That's what I said too. And when they asked Leigh about the scuffle, she said, I don't know. And then Dom was like, I'm going to answer that question. Exactly. Yeah. They like, Lay. she ain't messing up no money. No, nope, no money. Nothing. Everything. Because you, you can't you can't say nothing wrong when somebody say, just, it's just, I'm just, everything just blessed. We're just blessed. Okay? Can't say, can't mess up nobody, can't mess up nobody's money when everything is just a blessing. Now, like, Lay, how was it? Uh, You got bitch. It's just a blessing. I just learned from it. And we go on from there. And Lay, you had the winning bucket. And how was it? Just a blessing. I'm just glad to be here. Everything's a blessing. You hear me? Yes. Yeah, he's worried. For real worried. We need to more, worry more about Lexi Donarski more than De Deja Kelly. She's a three-point shooter with a hot hand. We need to shut her down. So all about Jazz, who do we put? Who you think we need to put on her? Yeah, she was third. Okay. I want VT to get as far as they can, but the problem won't. They probably won't get out the bracket. Dang. Damn, they beating up on Norfolk. Yeah. I'm a blessing. You can't mess that up. I'm telling you. Now that clip of Janiah Barker following Angel Reese. When the foul was called, Janiah started playing with her hair, trying to calm herself down. <laughs> I got to go see that one. That's on them. Nebraska, Alaska, the trailer and the tractor. That's their problem. RC. You notice our girls don't be commenting on drama or posting crazy stuff. Nothing. No. Nothing. Everything is happy. Everything is good. Everything. They like, how how hard Dawn work you? We, it's just a blessing. She just running and running. It's just a blessing. Nothing. We ain't messing up. Nothing. Yeah, just to be happy to be here. They was like, she was like, sometimes I just, after, the, after practice, I'm like, I'm just like, wow, I'm still here. I'm just here. I love it. We give great energy. I love it. But I know they cut up in the locker room. I'm sure that the jokes and the conversations just between them as a team have to be hilarious. Okay, we shutting the NC guards down. Okay, let's go. She might be bipolar. She's very talented, though. <laughs> Gosh. Yeah, please. Please find a clip for me. Oh, uh, Texas A&M down seven. Not true. Pop out, throw shade all the time on her Instagram story. She just posted something today. What? Spoiled brat? What'd she say? You got to Oh, oh, spoiled brat. Please tell me. Do I not follow Pow Pow? Because everybody else, uh, everybody else got just the blessing stories. Uh, uh, Pow Pow. And then I went, I seen uh, Raven and them. They was live. They All they was talking about was 
putting on their makeup and everything. Please tell me what she put up spicy, y'all. Yeah, I just hoop. I'm just I'm just out there hooping. <laughs> that was her other answer. I'm just hooping. Okay, Raven. I like Raven defense anyway. She did say it like a daycare. Yeah, uh, I'll answer that one. Uh, JC, I got that. Don't yeah, don't worry about that. Yeah, y'all tell me what do Pow Pow be saying? Pow Pow talking? Come on, y'all gotta tell me. Uh oh, wait a minute. Hold on. Wait, 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 wait. No, no. Let's let's we gonna we gonna just bring the receipts out. Bring the receipts out. Uh spoil brat, tell me. Somebody pull up Pow Pow's Instagram. Cause Denny's backyard says she seen that post. Even when Don cussed them out all the way to the locker room, they still look happy. They know ain't no better coach on the league. Exactly. She be like, what the fuck y'all doing? And they'd be like, this, it's just a blessing. So what did you say? Just whatever. They just happy. What does the post say? Oh, y'all got to catch me up now. Y'all know I've been at the, at the what, what does the post say? Go look, she reposted Angel on her story. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, so. You say you saying foul ball a little she got a little pettiness in her? A little pettiness in her? Okay. BT would probably have to get uh through Ohio State, Duke, USC. It's too many good teams to get through. Yeah. Wow, LL. When you put it like that, that is too much you have to get through. Look. <laughs> you wearing your emotions on your on your sleeve? Okay, you read an article about what we in the hours after losing the Natty game to LSU. It was touching, deep, little article read. RC, they just did it. They had a special on your girl. They had a good story on your girl on, uh, uh, what was that, ESPN? Is, is that ESPN? Got the story on Caitlin right now. Go go watch that, and that'll get your confidence back in the right spot, man, because you, you all over the place right now. You all over the place. All over the place, for real. Right, why would she do that? Today, okay, let me see. But she did. I was shocked when I seen it. Y'all, why, why y'all didn't tell me this earlier? We've been together all day. We've been together all day, fam. And y'all didn't tell me the pow pow was with was with the was with the shits. Come on, what? That was better than that. I thought we was better than that. How y'all ain't got me together? Oh, Renee, Danae, I don't know, I, I, you know, and I know, I think I knew that already. I think you tell us that all before. I'm sorry, Danae. I do it every time, don't I? Sometimes it's Danae, sometimes D Denny, I don't know. I know it's Backyard Garden. I'm going to get it, I'm going to get it right. Uh-oh, what happened? Uh, Bree Wayne, they said she did. Okay, wait a minute. On Instagram? Where's Instagram? Where's Instagram? Where's the ground? Who, who is Pow Pow on here? And I think I do follow Pow Pow. I th uh, let me see. Uh, Okay, y'all, uh, I don't see the post. Where is where where the post at? What is it? Is it a real? <laughs> I'm sorry, you weren't familiar with Pow Pow like that. Norfolk going to the tree, better than bruised. Dang. If you ain't talk talking, you ain't playing post. Oh, okay. Angel still has Camilla name in her mouth. It must be personal. Oh no. It's on her story. Okay. Yeah, Auburn men basketball went to the tree today. It's on her story. Trash talking. Oh, I'm okay with the, with some trash talking. I'm okay with some trash talking. Right? Uh 
I ain't never really went on her uh, Instagram. One YouTuber said he was at the SC versus LSU game, and SC players was laughing and joking in the tunnel where they were down at half right then. He knew LSU was going to lose. <laughs> Dang. Not bothered. Click back a few on the story. Uh. It look like it's going to be over early for Nebraska and uh, Texas A&M. It don't look like it's going to be uh, no action in the second half. Uh, Hmm. Hmm. This All right, pop out. Oh, what I miss. Uh, this game, th this game is born. Snoozer, they should have been on at two o'clock on a Friday. Them, they should, they shouldn't be closing out. They shouldn't be the late night, but I guess they, where they playing at. I'm still salty about Auburn men sending SC men to the tree. Then they get to the NCAA tournament and get sent to the tree in the first round. And by Yale, yes. When Dawn surprised her with her family, I knew she was gone. Hit at least four threes. She said her dad hates to fly. Dawn pulling strings and spinning the bag. Keep the girls happy. She don't mind spending. Snoozer. Straight snoozer. Was there any other upsets today? I definitely don't want to be on that page. Let me see. So we're going to kick this thing off at noon with part of the Tennessee game. And go back and forth between Tennessee and UConn. Is that what's happening? Mm, I want to see the golden child too. That is also good recruiting. What's that? You can tell these games boring. We ain't even talking about the current games. No, we just like on to the next game. Who is they? Other games. Stanford finna put Norfolk out. Okay, so. Ohio State won. Middle Tennessee, South Carolina, North Carolina, Duke, Texas, Virginia Tech, LSU, Kansas State, Alabama, Baylor, Colorado, Iowa State, Oregon State. I think my bracket fell apart. No, no, no. Uh, well, I, I guess Iowa State don't even really count as an upset. It wasn't. I don't think it was any upsets, was it? Definitely not like in the men. Hey, it was upsets. That, the, it was upset crazy in the, on the men's side. And then I seen the day look like NL, NIL killed the uh, NBA G League. Anybody else see that? They're like G League is shutting down NIL, <laughs> taking all the players. Paige and Aaliyah better pop out tomorrow or I'm leaving the game. <laughs> no, you can't leave the game. Dang. Stanford game is okay. 
I was hoping Texas A&M would have showed up and put up a little fight or something. No, embarrassing the SEC right now. They embarrassing the SEC. Mm. Anybody still got a good bracket? Who still got a good bracket? Oh, Louisville was upset. You right, RC? Not for real. Maybe kind of upset for real. Kind of was. It, it, it was. Um, I had them pick. I I did pick Middle T Tennessee Tennessee on one bracket and Louisville on another. Well, I saw IG post. She didn't call out anyone or comment. She just reposted the post. Yeah. Uh, yeah, he got, I mean, he got to do something all about jazz. Louisville, Middle Tennessee was the only one. Uh-oh. Danae's back garden, backyard, what, garden, what you got in that garden? Uh-oh. Uh, yep, only upset on the women's. Just our bracket upset. <laughs> Baylor beat Vandy. That's not an upset, though, is it? They was ranked five. They should have beat Vandy. I can't, just came back in. You were saying what happened to the G League. Uh, it looked like G League uh, Ignite is over with. Sound like to me. Looked like it was shutting down after this season. I think the NIL, NBA to shut down the uh, G League Ignite next season. It's a done deal. Is it? They said NIL killed it. Pow Pow shouldn't have repost, reposted that, though. Nope. Hey, maybe the WNBA, maybe that's what they need. Maybe the WNBA need a G League. <laughs> maybe, that, maybe that would help. Give them some other places for people to play. I don't know. Yeah, NBA G League Ignite, over with. That's not the whole G League, though. I guess that's just like team, one team. I think that's just one team, y'all. I might, I might have misunderstood. It's just one team. I'm sorry, RC. Louisville messed mine up. They killed my bracket. Oh, yeah. That, that, yeah. Also, Reese looked like she was in her head big time about Camilla Dane. Camilla, don't be even, don't be saying anything. You think so? I thought, mm. All your brackets, okay. I feel like Bree Wayne, if my team don't lead all game long by at least seven points, I start panicking. RC, you got to cut this out, man. You got to cut this out. Jazz Shelly passing skills very mediocre right now. <laughs> about Pow Pow? Uh-oh. Brie Wayne, what you said about Pow Pow? Oh, she shouldn't have reposted that? I think it was Reese was more mad about what the media was saying, not mad at uh, KC. Okay. I can see that. The way the media went on about it. That's how we familiar with each other. We are in a, in a garden competition together. The Black YT garden community is tight. Oh, okay. Maybe they want to be garden soil for the tree. I don't know. RC. <laughs> she was mad at Camilla enough to pull her hair. <laughs> Can't say nothing about that. Dang. Because uh, she did pull that girl hair. And I kept trying to see. I, I kept wanting it to be that she had just got her hand caught in Camilla hair. And maybe yanked it a little bit trying to get her, her, her hand out of her hair. But when I saw the video, she pulled her hair. Yeah, yeah. Good point, Al, yo. If they had tried it before NIL. Helter Skelter, she, man. My bump brackets is dust. Go look at the post on what Reese said about Camilla. Uh, on IG or on TikTok? Where, 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 where's uh, Reese post at? If Norfolk can't get to single digits, can get to single digits at the end of the third, they might have a chance. Who knows? Yeah, if they can get it to single digits, I don't know if they want to, though. That, that was a little rusty today. Michigan State start to mess up. Believe everybody's bracket. Louisville took my bracket now. Yeah, me too. I think they took me. I don't even know if I'm still in the competition. Yeah, I, like I said, I didn't like the I didn't like the body language that I saw from Reese. I didn't like the interaction. I didn't I didn't like the disengagement. That I saw uh, after whatever she said to Moki, whether that was she was going back in the game or why you ain't doing your job or whatever she said. After that happened and her disengagement in the uh, 
in the uh, two huddles immediately after that, I, I'm, I was concerned. Straight up. You va- you vamping too, huh? <laughs> People were saying Camilla was going to dog walk her. She had to respond. You can't let nobody just keep on just keep on saying nothing like that. No, Got to say something. She ain't had to respond, but it's Angel, so of course she's going to respond. So I, I I see it in I see it on both sides. Okay, she could have not said nothing and then just showed up and let her game speak for herself. Yes, or I can't let you just keep uh talking about me. But again, it, it what it I think it was more the media um than than it was uh, K, uh KC. RC, you got embarrassed for for <laughs> for picking up. Huh? Well, RC, come on. Even though I didn't pick them on every bracket, I ain't picking them <laughs> no more. Uh, I think the movie had y'all believing in Marshall more than the team. I was like, we are Marshall. I heard of them before. I go with it. Mm-mm. Uh, let me see. Let me see. All about jazz. Who is saying what? People, which I believe were the media, was saying that Camilla was going to dog walk Angel. And so Angel responded like, you know, basically like she's not gonna dog walk me. Not that Camilla was saying anything, but people, and I'm I'm thinking this people in the media, y'all correct me if I'm wrong, was saying that she, you know, that Camilla was gonna dog walk her and so she had to say something. Did I get that right, chat? Help me out. I had Marilyn and Marshall in the suite in three out of four brackets. So yeah, my bracket's shaky as fuck. Yeah. The bracket we made together is number 14. Yeah, you've been in. You've been listen. We've been calling your name all day wrong. You hear me? You hear me tonight? All all day wrong. Like Denny in number one. No, I think I think Coach was saying it right. You, you hope Angel can fight. She be taking it too far on the court. Trash talking, but leave it on the court. As long as it stay on the court. As long as it stay on the court. It don't have to go. I, I hope it don't have to get to no fight. Trash talking just a little, little fun. But it wasn't Camilla talking though, right? Or was it? No, I don't think it was. Uh. Camilla talking, it was just people trying to egg stuff on, people trying to keep stuff going. I don't, I've never really seen Camilla do uh, much trash talking outside of what I've seen her do on the court. Angel could have kept it pushing, but we know how she rolled. She could have, she could have, she could have been a bigger person, but it wasn't Camilla. Uh, well, Camilla would dog walker and she proved that. You think LL? All I knew about Marshall was the movie and Randy Moss went there. I better never see Marshall again or I'm going to beat him with a pair of Crocs. <laughs> I mean, for real, though, folks playing like Camilla couldn't really put up a fight for real. I would hate to see either one of them get into a fight, but I'm sure that she could. I don't think she have. I don't. I, I think Angel and Camilla have, have played together so long that I don't think that it's beef, but I think it is a healthy competition. But I think that there are people that want to see it be a beef. And I think the conversation around who would dog walk who started by. Moki being like, I wish Cardoso would have pushed Angel because that, that, that was more what the comment was about. So I think that's kind of where just even thought about who would win, who would dog walk, who came from uh, Moki being like, I w- you know, I wish you would have pushed Cardoso. So I don't, I don't think it's Camilla at all. And I, I don't I understand in, a, in, in, in some in some ways the response, but I also understand it um, based on her brand and just being um, the bigger person that, that Angel could have let it go. They got a nicer workout room than the WNBA. Y'all seen that uh, workout room on Invesco commercial? Oh, okay. It started at the FIBA. Camilla did put, put in work, but she didn't just put in work on Angel. She put in work on everybody. She looked like the best player of the tournament in some parts of the FIBA. But I do think Angel hates that people say Camilla's better than her, so she always responds. I mean, okay, I can see that, but. The, the best response then, if that's what it is, is to get you is is to play better. Moki never take responsibility. I don't like her for real. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to see a fight for real like at all. But I'm just saying, Camilla could definitely hold her own against Angel. Hopefully, that whole situation and aftermath is over with. No part two. Yeah, I hope that it's just back to basketball. Let's just get back to basketball. 
Physically doesn't win. Physicality doesn't win every game. Maryland was slightly more physical and still lost the game. No, physicality and smarts for sure. Got to play the game with your brain first. Uh, this, this maybe this is why they was on late. They should have been on it uh, like about nine o'clock this morning when people was having coffee and, and waking up to this. They, this could have been a play-in game. Because really, neither one of these teams need the beer. This is horrible. They all on ESPN, you and everything. That's how I can tell they didn't think too much about them. <laughs> they tree bound. <laughs> Don doesn't let her players taunt. She lets them prove themselves on the court. And I think it's even in LSU, they both had points, rebounds, and two blocks each on each other. That's my opinion. Um. So, all about jazz, I could say yes between, um, you know, the games that were at Baton Rouge and then in Greenville definitely were, were even. But the FIBA game, that wasn't even. Camilla Cardoso got down at FIBA. Uh, so, I, so it could, I, it could go back to FIBA is what I'm saying. I, it, it possibly it goes back to that. But I, I think uh, Cardoso got down in FIBA. Uh, I, LSU just didn't look like LSU today. They just didn't look like LSU. I don't know if they was just a little rusty. Uh, they just have been through a lot. Uh, last year, Poa and everything being out. Um, I don't know how much they got all to practice together, how long she's been out of concussion protocol. They just didn't seem they – didn't, they didn't all seem on the same page. Now, Kim said that they were selfish. It was a selfish, ugly game, so maybe they just got to get back to playing team ball. But they didn't look like the, the same LSU that showed up to play us twice this year. There's always uh, somebody better than you, and it's just other people's opinion. If Angel thinks she's better than Camilla, let her think that. Yeah, for sure. Uh, LSU should not want to get back to play South Carolina again. They will only get their little uh, fee-fees hurt. They want to come. They they competitors. Them ladies want to see. They want to see South Carolina again. You know, Big Four want to see us again. Angel want to see us again. They want to see us again. I think if not a play-in, this really could have been the first or second game of the day or something. Uh, yeah, I think that they could have had SC on at like five or something, but I understand when everybody was saying that this was something that Dawn asked for uh, to be able to make sure that we as well rested. I, I Well, I take it. The break was too long. Okay. They always show up to play the big dogs. <laughs> They're not going to stop till they win. Okay. I watched some post game after the game. They said if LSU was playing anybody else, they would have lost. Hmm. Okay. I think if they was playing anybody else, they would have showed up different. So, But if they would have played like this, I could have seen them losing against uh, a, round, a, a team that would, that we would sus- you know, probably more suspect to make it to round two. I think Angel wants to come back just so she can play SC again. I think so, but I don't know if she want to come back to LSU and play SC again. But maybe put a team together someplace else and play SC again that has had locker room issues a few times this season. I keep hearing that. LSU and SC would. Yeah, it'd be another epic battle for sure. Uh, I think I think Flage had a pretty good game today. I want to say Morrow had 15. Flage ended up, Big Four had like 14, I think. Uh, y'all correct me if I'm wrong. Let me see. No sound though. The linear lattes, that's for sure. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, Flaugé went 14 points, three rebounds, four assists, one steal, one block. Morrill had 15, Michaela Williams had 14, and Angel had 10. She had, Angel had 10 and 19. That's crazy. 10 points, 19 rebounds. Jeez. That girl going to get the rebound. I think Morrill's sick of all of them. She never looks happy. Really? 
I would say this, Nebraska got two faces, a game face and a shame face today. I think they're wearing their shame face. I don't got time. RC, I don't got time for you. Never smile. Man, people saying it's a lot of drama going on at LSU. I saw a couple YouTubers reporting that, but I don't know uh, for sure. Morrow and Reese had another mishap on rebound first quarter again, and you can see Morrow frustration. Damn, they was fighting over a rebound again? I got to see that. In their defense, though, Nebraska still winning, even though it's an ugly game. Okay. Where else in the country could, could Reese go and have her way? Uh, Doc Glover, I'm going to say this after the way. Uh, after the way, uh, Camilla Cardoso took Kelly Kelly uh, Kelly Harper's soul in Tennessee. She might be open. She might be open for to Terry Poole or for for Angel Reese. Um, yeah, yep. She might be able to go right to Tennessee and have her way. She might just for one season. Rocky Top, they want they want to win at Rocky Top so bad. They almost wasn't in the tourney this year. Like, you know, I, not like that, but they've been in the tourney every year. So they dying to get a to get a to get another uh, championship in, in uh Tennessee. So maybe maybe Tennessee will take a take a take a shot. I don't know. What y'all think? Uh it's been a CC show today. They've had a lot of coverage on CC today. It, it, um, I'm I'm with you. In the FIBA game, Camila was on one, and LSU was nervous. They got exposed. They didn't play as a team. Something was definitely off. And so I seen a YouTuber that did a story about what happened back way back when, and I guess they said that there was like a big fight in the locker room, somebody believed, and that there was beef between uh, Big Bo and Angel Reese. Did y'all see that? I don't. I, I don't know. I don't I don't know about that. I, I haven't been able to get no real confirmation. Everybody is saying what they think, but I don't see nobody showing no receipt. They like they heard this, that. I mean, I saw a couple of tweets go up. I saw people did share tweets like from people's parents, but I, I ain't never really nobody confirmed that it was no fight. That's her final time to shine at the college level. Um there's a lot of seniors um final time to shine at the college level, RC. No, I'm kidding, RC. Uh, she, she, she's earned it, but it's Ernie time. Um, and I hope that they talk about some of these other phenomenal performances a lot. Audie Crooks, 40 points, freshman. I hope she gets some, I hope she gets some, 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 some live feed tonight for real. I wouldn't be surprised if she low key wish she would have transferred elsewhere. Damn. Okay. Y'all still talking about, uh, Morrow? I didn't watch much of Middle Tennessee. Can they get LSU? Let's face it, LSU did look great in the tournament last year. Big Von Lay type bodies always get Reese problems. Really? Okay. I didn't. I didn't. Uh, I didn't watch Middle Tennessee. Somebody had to speak up for that one on me. Uh, for me, please, y'all. Tell Charles. As did you say Reese was barking at Moki today? Well, she looked like she wanted to slap the shit out of uh, Moki. Came out. It looked like she said something like, "Do your job" or something like. And then it was just like a stare down, and then it was just like I'm I'm not participating anymore in this. Now some now Doc Glover did say he saw uh, Angel tell Moki that she was going back in the game. So I don't know if it was just like playing time, if she didn't like the way that she was being subbed in. From when they was hugging, and it was like I love my coach, and she's changed my life. It didn't it didn't feel like that today? It it didn't it didn't feel like that today. Um, and then I keep hearing people say that Moki has a really, really soft spot for uh, Big Four because she reminds her of her or something. So I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I would love for these ladies at, at some point, um, if it is something wrong, to speak to it or at least get out get out of the situation. Get some place where you where you feel like uh, where they love you at. Don't be some place where they where they don't love you at just to be there. Um, you know, because you only get to be you only get to be in college. This, a certain time of your life and so get everything that you can get out of basketball so if you're not happy there moral please hit the portal you know i'm 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 pro portal over here hit the portal middle of the season your coach ain't letting you play you up 45 hit the portal uh, she picked lsu over sc canceled her visit that's it that's that I, mean, I don't know no details but it just seems like there's been some drama with lsu this season there's definitely something going on they've definitely tried to keep it as much in the locker room as they can there's one YouTuber that had a timeline that was flashing like the different uh, tweets and Instagram things that was going up in the comments. Like she did a real in-depth uh, timeline about everything that she thought happened. But again, it was just speculation. 
interpretation of what they were what they were choosing what they were commenting. And somebody was saying, "Y'all don't want me to start talking." And somebody else was saying, "I got receipts." And it it, it was a lot of it was a lot of insinuation, but no no real uh no real facts that I really saw. Um, I don't know if they, they didn't look fine now. They, they didn't look fine now, but maybe they are. So. What did you did you watch the game, Spoil Brat? And what did you see from from LSU today? They was just rusty. Is that you thought you felt like they was just rusty? They blow Middle Tennessee out. They know Bigs like number thirty five from Rice. Number thirty five from Rice. That junior, uh, she did her job today. She had one job and she did it. They always talking about CC. I get it, but at the same time, she don't need to be mentioned in every game. I agree, LL. Let's 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 let's, let's keep every every game in perspective. Texas saying them only down six, five. Do you think fans should respect other teams' fan bases at all times? Because fans can definitely be nasty amongst each other and let the games get to them personally. I've seen a lot of dirty interaction. Um, uh, I like to talk some trash when I'm at the game. If I'm at the game, I'm, I'm, I'm just like I am at the house. I'm not disrespecting anybody. I'm not calling anybody they, about their name. Get the ball, score, that kind of stuff. Boo your team. Boo, but um. I don't engage with people who seem like they take it too personal because it's not it's nothing personal in sports. It's no crying in basketball. It's nothing personal about basketball. So I I, choo- I pick and choose who I who I who I go back and forth with because I tell you in a minute you don't watch enough basketball to talk basketball with me. I tell you in a minute you don't watch enough to talk basketball with me. So let's not go there because because it'll just end up in an argument. So let's not go there because you you're gonna take it too personal and it's not. Um, but I, I don't mind the trash talking, but I, I do think that. Sometimes fans get a little out of control, like that coming out the stand, threatening players' families, uh, some of this crazy stuff that you hear going on with like Westbrook and some of these other players, uh, back and forth, putting your hands on them and all of that. That's all out of bounds. It's all out of bounds. Uh, I remember that. I don't know if you consider anybody else besides the team, but I just want, wouldn't be surprised if you wish you could first one up. The drama has to be overwhelming. Well, that's simply because she's fired. The season is winding down for every, everyone, even if she's just to be right. <laughs> they let Colorado and LSU make it to play each other, and by leg will be ready for three. Okay. I said that looked like she was said, oh, okay. Yeah, because Angel don't, Angel, that's one thing about Angel. She don't hold you up. She's going to tell you, she's going to ask, she's going to say what's on her mind. It don't matter who it is. She's going she to say what's on her mind. So he probably did say, fuck, like, fuck, you going back in the game. What are you doing? Angel said, do you want me to go back in? And Moki said, yes. Everyone on that team knows Moki runs the show. Uh, okay. Uh, I don't, I don't, I don't know. I guess, I mean, I guess to a certain, does Moki run the show? I mean, she's a coach, so I guess to a certain extent. Um. Maybe she is in charge. And maybe I guess my 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 I guess maybe then the challenge for me is that she does run the show, but um because everybody's attitude is gonna reflect the leadership. Maybe I just don't think she's a very good leader. Um because I don't I don't think that LSU shows up and plays like a team. And I think that if they if they had a different type type of coach, maybe, um, to get them all on the same page, they would play more like a team. This is my opinion. Um Oh, AIO, I seen you with uh, Faris. I don't know, but I'm nervous. Perfect. You know you are. I seen that. Looks like he said something that Kim was like, okay. I think it must. Will Reese leave LSU? Would they still be as popular? Yeah, I think Big Bo is still there. Michaela is there. Uh, you got uh, Rashard coming in. I think I think that I, I think the LSU will, will still be uh, popular. But I think that there are going to be some other schools, schools that are going to be popular too. The other schools got some nice recruiting classes coming in. Notre Dame, people are going to be talking more about Notre Dame next year. Um, I think Juju going to get some help from there. Uh, NC State, maybe some maybe in Tuna Watch. Uh, UConn, depending if they're healthy. There be a lot of teams that you'll be able to talk about next year. Um, but I think LSU will still be there. I think that they, they still have a nice score. 
if you look at Kim and her playing days and they know they could pass for twins. Oh, I got to pull it up, Doc Glover. Somebody said something about receipts that nobody wanted them to start talking when. Um, it's a YouTuber that put up. Um, I was saying I didn't see no receipts. I just seen the different uh, tweets and stuff going up. But nobody, it was like her interpretation. I didn't see no receipts. But it was, it was players saying, y'all don't want me to start talking. And then somebody else was like, yeah, you don't want me to say, say nothing. I had to pull it up. I'm going to try to find it in a, and post it for you so you can see it. Because uh, you'll be able to see the different people who was tweeting. Because I can't remember off the top of my head. I'm not saying she's not fire. I like her, but they don't try to bring her up every time. Yeah. I think if Reese goes anywhere in the pack, post, she's going to get more shine and talk to CC. But of course, somebody wants to see her lead. Well, I mean, maybe she can go pack 12 next year. They whistle after this game. 32 to 2 on my screen. This is going on and on forever. It's 30 points. Eight minutes into the third. It's eight minutes left in the third. Seems like I hear people speak well of mid Tennessee coaching program. Can they be coached up? Three Wayne, what do you think about that? Okay. You think they just needed to knock the dust off? All right. Let's see what they look like on Sunday. Reese should have went to Utah. That coach would have caught her three. You think that's what she needs to add to her game, Drew Wayne, the three? LSU shows no leadership and no show no leadership and no chemistry today. And I think that's what I think that's what most of said. They play selfish and ugly. Nah, uh, yeah, Nebraska is pretty hard. Oh, they still up eleven on my TV. Some people definitely take it too far. Ain't nothing wrong with trash talking. It's just a little verbal. People can do it too much sometimes. It definitely doesn't need to be a physical. Never. I got my Sunday margarita ready. What time are we this rivalry game? <laughs> oh, we ain't got no time yet. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Let me see. All right, y'all, put a two in the chat if I fix the sound on the mic. They need to for three call timeout. Okay, I'm back. Thanks, Mike Jinx. Now, what did I miss? Reese and Flaugé sent Pia and Williams out there to get chewed up by the press. Uh, dang. Today? Yeah, I straight blocked the dude on Facebook and the women. You live in your grandma's basement and wear a helmet. That kind of shit is uncalled for. It. Yeah, come on, man. That's lame. If UConn can't get, get strong, they should definitely get uh, SMB from the portal because when they got York and Lou, it made the team way better. Uh, I don't think Strong going there. I don't think Strong is going there, but maybe. I don't, I don't think she's going there. To control their emotions. Their emotions start to get the best of them. Then I see people on Twitter and Facebook talking mad shit. Sometimes I'll be thinking I'm just going to do YouTube. The limit TikTok and Twitter and Facebook. Um... Uh, I mean, you're gonna get you're gonna get those people that talk. They come and go, but for real, for the most part, see, really, I think once you once you start uh, once you start building out your base, you you'll, you'll weed them out. I had some weirdos in the beginning coming in, saying a lot of crazy stuff. Um, uh, do my best to keep it off out of my YouTube comments. Um, but you get some you get some weirdos. They come with the territory. They come with the territory. 
but I think um overall for for the most part though the the, the engagement overall is so popular that uh, I mean it's so positive that you'll weed the rest of that stuff out. Nebraska gonna win tonight, okay. Delay need Texas to get it together and pull it out. Mike Jink, I think she's gonna stay in North Carolina somewhere. I was saying the NC State. Um coach Coach Rowe was saying he thinks uh University of North Carolina. I think UNC is uh on her on her finals list. I don't think NC State is, so maybe North Carolina, but UConn was still there too. But and Duke. Maybe she ends up at Duke with Carol Austin. That's a good question, Spoil Brad. I wonder who does pick who to, who goes out to do the presser. You think everywhere RC just stay with the with the cool kids like us. Yeah. It's weird. Yep, Duke, UNC, UConn are final three. You didn't tell me Aleska Smarkowski was just strong. She body in the SEC girlies. <laughs> yeah, I know Janaya real emotional. I think she might be getting a little better at it, but she's definitely still very emotional. Yeah, they come with it. Come, it she'll, grow out, she'll, she'll grow out of it as she continues to develop her game. Moki in the press asking what time her team plays Sunday. How does she not know this LSU press conference alone shows how they get down. I don't think I think everybody's to be determined right now, right? For Sunday still. Ain't no real reef between no real beef between AR and KC. It's just Randall's trolls online. Keep messing up, keep the mess going. The players need to stop taking the cheese. Okay, buddy Ro, I'm with it. And maybe they take the cheese in public and then everybody's out having a good time. Uh tonight hanging out. They all in the same hotel laughing at the silly stuff the media. Yeah, you're right, since my first show you to uh, tell me hang it up. I wish you would go away. You don't know anything. I would always reply. I love the most of motivation. When I get them all, I get it all. I get it all. I hate lesbians. Uh, I hate black girls. Uh, what else? Uh, the show sucks. Uh, man, I, I just seen I just seen all kind of crazy stuff. I see all kind of crazy stuff. Uh, I just respond back. To, yeah, man, thanks for joining the conversation, man. I, I see all kind of crazy stuff. Sometimes I just don't have anything to say back. But you know, for me, engagement is engagement. YouTube doesn't know if it's positive or not. So you know, all they know is somebody commented. So that helps the, it helps the algorithm. That's all, that's all I know. So, I mean, negative or positive, it's engagement. Uh, I wonder if that fight between LSU and SC makes strong decision easier for her. Possibly could have. But. I don't think that it really had anything to do with that. I think it really comes down to whether she wanted to have to, to wait her turn or if she wanted to be able to make it a, a immediate impact. You never know what's going on, being the person asking all kind of questions. Now, when she was like, I think I thought coaches get through all too if they leave the pitch. That one kind of threw me off. It was like, you know, come on, Kim, you got championships and everything. That one threw me off. The time for Sunday, okay. Make, nobody may know that yet, but you didn't know if the folks were out or not. That was kind of weird. I remember feeling bad for Janaya when she had to coach in the regular season, and the next time she played in, she got hit in the head. Reached again, she was crying in Johnny's arms on the sidelines. She had a rough season. Okay, she thinks they're strong going to UNC. Maybe she just didn't want to go to the SEC. That's, that's, that's another good point for her, right? Hello, thanks for the view. Absolutely. Uh, deep uh, about trolls. We appreciate you. Oh, I don't worry about them trolls. <laughs> I don't worry about them. The, the, the thing is, RC, like, they'll, they'll try to find you. It, it, it happens uh, It happens automatically. Like, it's, it's, it's organic. As long as you keep setting, setting the mic on, the people that really is into it, they're going to keep coming back. Bro, man, don't let that, don't let it discourage you. Keep your mates up yeah, Joyce Edwards, Robert, I was watching some, some, some film on her yet on, on her last night. So impressive. Stuff is impressive. Six two impressive. Great mind, great, great high basketball IQ. Winner. Hey, that girl, she's something else. That's that's a link. She's gonna be a problem. I don't care what big ten teams fall as long as Iowa keep singing rises to keep rising to the top. You know. Uh give it all you got, give it all you got, 
you know, have seven four now. Right? I know that response to the kind of conversations for me to me, probably responding like they go up in the algorithm and saw this too. You know. You sound like you in the water says again. Mm. Mm. Okay, let me try this mic. I'll put it two in the chat if y'all can hear me. <laughs> I didn't leave the building on y'all. I got to figure out this mic. Y'all put it two in the chat if y'all can hear me. All right. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, so I'm back. Let me switch the mic up on. You know where I leave off? A mic killing me. You went to a new mic. I mean, as long as I will keep winning. Okay, let me catch back up. 4735, 249 left. Sorry about that, y'all. No, I think my mic got tired. How the coach for all the years don't know all this. Okay. So y'all okay, UNC, UNC. Okay. She wants the Jordan bag. Mm. Okay, okay. Rico, what's good? What? Nebraska went four or five from three? 
Uh, 47, 35. Freestyle Friday. Hey, hey, is this thing on? You know what I'm saying? Testing, testing. I did not have killed one mic. My mic sounds nice. Check one. Let's go. Dang. What slugfest? You think Texas still got time? Do they got any energy left? Cooler Bali know to, know to get busy now. They still got a whole quarter left. Let's see what happens. All right, let's see what happens. Okay, we play 40 minutes. Ah, man, listen, we just hanging out. We talking basketball anyway. It don't bother me. Uh, Del Rosario didn't score no points. Oh, she only played six minutes. Okay. Y'all think some uh, some Louisville going to hop in the portal? Uh, it's a possibility. Two more hours before we hope we get some good action again. Uh, what? Oh, Tennessee? Nine-point game. <laughs> Slug fast, really? That's what I'm saying. Uh, I don't think that she has enough help, but let's see what happens. I don't, I don't think she got enough help, y'all. I cannot wait to watch this uh this Artie Crooks uh forty point uh show out. I cannot wait to watch that. Oh, Athletes Unlimited is still going. Okay. Iceman working on her game. Janae can't score two points, but her legs scored 35 points for me. <laughs> uh, RC, yeah, you stop. You stop. Yeah. You said Tennessee in 12 hours. Jackson State is 13. <laughs> okay. Uh, one quarter left. I think it's gonna get close. I think it's gonna get close. I think Texas A&M tries to make it. I think they try to make it a fight, y'all. That's what I'm calling. I'm calling my shot. Texas A&M gonna try to make it close. Maybe not. Let me see. I might just be playing. Let me see what they do with the ball this time. Yeah, no, I was just playing. They not. Uh. Down by like 20 at the half. Yes, Audi Crooks. Can't wait. Really pretty long legs, okay? Now we all off topic. RC. Been a couch player. This is the best time of year for basketball. Robert, it is a snoozer. Oh. One point. Okay. Get, get it. Keep it straight. Keep it straight. I mean, she just ran up there and pushed her. Why? They letting them dribble too much. They not really pressing the issue with them, y'all. I think this a wrap. I think is I, I think it's because they well nah they in they in Albany so I don't know why this game's so late. That was a great question. Find your own own girl. Wait, I'm not even supposed to like LSU players. Says they caught me red. <laughs> Hand in the cookie jar. Would have come to SC Don would have let her play during non conference. She would have been a defensive menace because she got that tall body. Mm. That's good. I mean, we can, well, I guess everybody can't go to SC. I've been at work watching hoops since 12, came home still watching. Yes, this is the best time of the year for hoops, I'm trying to tell y'all. 
Chiefs try to make a sneak. I haven't seen every game today, but I've seen several. This is really my second favorite time of the year. What's your first? What's your favorite time of the year? AIO? It's a, uh, what's your favorite time of the year? Kenny, hurry up and get this over. They just dragging it on. Kenton wouldn't play before uh, Bree Hall, though. No, would not. Not before Bree. Man, we've been rocking all day, y'all. Okay, Kent. She'd have got more minutes than she is at LSU right now. At least some run. Robert, for real. I just realized how late it is and they still playing. <laughs> you see me sleep on that bench. <laughs> That's probably a weird time for them not to play, too. They'll never play this late. So it's probably a weird time for them to even be on the court. But it's tourney time. It's the best time of the year. Is Albany one playing in Oregon? Uh, regular season baseball, listen, I understand. Anytime, listen, anytime you can go to a game, go to sleep at the game and wake up and see everything that's important on the on the big screen, you don't have to be there for the whole game. I'm trying to tell you. Now, playoff, playoff baseball, World Series baseball, special games, I'm there for it. Regular season, ah, uh, give me the highlights. Okay, oh, okay, I got you, I got you, I got you. In terms of basketball, okay. I thought you were saying it was another better sports time. I got you. Spooky season. I got you. Okay, so who's the first number one getting knocked out? Who's that first number one going home? I think it's Iowa. Sorry, RC. Yes. Have a great night. See you in the chat tomorrow. Yes. I said Iowa too, Elliot. LL. -L. Iowa. Okay. Sorry, RC. I think, I think Juju might drop 45 or 50. I think she might drop 45 or 50, especially since Audi didn't drop 40. 40, a uh, 50 piece is out there now. The yeah, Iowa. Okay, Bree Wayne, LSU. Iowa. Colorado look good. They could beat them. And that's the problem. Iowa bracket is... Phew. That man, that's that's a buzz. So you they can catch it at every level. It, they don't catch a break. They don't catch a break at all. They got they got to win. They got to go through some folks to get the uh to, to get to that natty. Sorry, RC. Who, who, who do you think is the first number one to go out? LSU isn't the number one seat. <laughs> Texas, okay. Texas, all right. Forty-eight forty. Y'all still giving Texas a chance? Forty-eight forty. I agree. If they make it out that bracket, they deserve that championship. Shelly is cold. His ice taking. Shots not going in.
You talking take Texas. Okay. You like Peely against uh against Booker. Uh, yeah, that is the bloodbath bracket. Who does Texas play tomorrow? Who does Texas play tomorrow? Well, I don't remember. Texas already played, didn't they? Yeah, they beat Drexel. Texas played today. They beat Drexel. I don't know who they play again. Who they play next? Okay, Parker's back. Okay. It reminds you of a joke. It reminds me of a bad nightmare. Oh, no. Five points, three turnovers? Yeah. Dang, Jazz Shelley. Not a good game at all. It, I think top seeds are coming into the tournament too confident, and that's going to be their downfall. Oh, wow. Okay. What's going to happen when Iowa gets out early? Are they going to keep playing all these CC commercials? Yes. Oh, yes. This is just the beginning. This is we we are on a media blitz right up through right up through the WNBA draft. Absolutely, those commercials is finna keep. She's gonna have time to shoot more. Yes, get ready. CC commercials everywhere. Watch, watch, watch how many uh endorsement deals this young lady gets. But I want to see Juju and Moro to go head to head. Just saying, really. Hmm. Okay. I mean, I like Moral. I think I think she's a hell of a player. Uh, I think it could it could be a good matchup. I, I, Juju's a walking bucket too. Yeah, what's the joke? Or is it just a bad joke? I want to say it might be a rap, but if Nebraska go cold and AM find a spark, I don't know. Right? Ten, they not, it's, it's a ten point game, but they have to make it a game right now. Then the baby mama they ain't seen the child support check in two years. Oh, yes, that's cold. Hard to find a real winner. Oh, wow. Spoil Brad, you haven't seen Juju at all? If you get a chance, please, watch watch her game against Stanford where she gave Cameron Brink that 51. That's a, that's a good one to watch. Oh, Cameron Brink had a double-double tonight. Okay. Right, the Iowa Tour will be over at that point, but CC Tour going to keep trucking. Yes, commercials and all. Please believe it. The media blitz is just beginning. Texas A&M got to come down and get a stop. Can y'all get a stop? Let's pull up right. I'll just cry in a few beers and shot glasses if CC and Iowa get eliminated and then pick myself up by my shoestrings. And... <laughs> you know what? Stop it. Texas going to get Alabama? Late, but I can't complain in mountain time zone. Texas A&M still hanging around. Uh, Nolan, you you ain't late. Janiah Barker about to get a technical. <laughs> Texas, can they get a stop? I seen Juju play in person. She's smart on the court. Okay. Texas versus Alabama. Okay. I don't know who I would pick in that game. Probably Texas. Y'all not going to let me bury my head like an ostrich in the sand if I... No! No, we coming looking for you. We come looking for you, Hawkeyes guy. We come. We are coming to look for you. Please. Ain't nobody... Left, man. No, I'm coming to look for you. I just don't... It just don't feel like Texas A&M can get, get over this eight-point this eight point hump. Oh, the Bird and Tarasi show. Hmm. Huh. Need to get hot for them to win this game. Uh, can she get out? Is it look? Is it too little, too late? Yeah, we're gonna have to see you on the stream after that, Playboy. 
Yeah, mine too. Refs in, in the favor of Nebraska. Okay, you got to stop. Now, can you come down and get a score? Oh, wow. Hmm. Five-point game. You ain't lying. CC get more shine in the sun. How is that possible when you got the only undefeated team in all sports right now not getting as much conversation? I'm over it. That ESPN machine is something else. You think UCLA is getting past LSU? Uh, I picked LSU over uh, UCLA. The rest this year are so trash. <laughs> Told you we're gonna be passing out missing missing flyers with RC name on, with RC name on them. No, we ain't letting them go nowhere. I see twenty one points in the second half. Wow. 52 47. 54-47 for me. Captain Will don't have Caitlin Clark or Juju on his first and second team. Um, I she might not be on my first team. I don't know. I would have to think about that. Juju is probably on my first team. Caitlin, I'm um, probably would at least be on my second team. I would have to think about my first team, but I don't know that she's on my first team either, Robert. Every game, Paige yelling at refs is funny as hell. <laughs> okay, six point game. Five minutes left. Texas A&M, who are you? SEC, stand up. Gosh. Oh, man, what the hell? When is that? Okay, four-point game. She's hurt. Oh, my. She's hurt. Damn, I hate to see that. I'll probably never comment in Captain Will chat. I'll probably get banned off top as an IR Iowa and Clark fan. <laughs> Four point game. I don't know who that is down, but uh, she knew she was hurt right away. Uh, is her leg broken? What's happening here? Or is she just cramping? Is it her knee? Is she cramping? What's going on here? I caught a cramp. I'm not a CC hater, but I would put a Leo on the first team instead of her. Okay. Tore her ACL. Hold on. Wait. Bree Wayne? Is that what they said? She landed on her knee. It looked like she was holding her calf, though. I hope she ain't tore her ACL. They like, come on. They like, come on. One time. Why not us? We got to get stops. Look at them talking to each other. Okay, they hype. Yeah, she okay. Yeah, she walking it off. Gary Payton played better defense than Ray Allen says, but that still don't mean you choose GPO. I, 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 I absolutely would. Absolutely. Absolutely would. You know I would. You know I'm picking the glove over Ray Allen. You know I'm picking the glove over Ray Allen. RC, I'm sorry, but I am. I think it was her knee. Okay. I think she'll be okay. All right. Four-point game. Texas A&M, stand up. Stand up, Texas A&M. We might have stayed up for something good here. What y'all think now? Two-point game. Can Texas A&M pull it off? Can they pull it off? Y'all hung in here with me to see it come down to the end. The amount of injuries this year, absolutely. And, and the, the, the amount of knee injuries, insane. Okay, Texas a and trying to stand up. Okay, cool, Bali. <laughs> Dang, Bree Wayne, just like that, they go into the tree. They let they let Texas hang around too long, huh? Headed to the tree. 
We're gonna find out. They got we gotta play 40 minutes. Did I tell you somebody in the YouTube comment section said you you can boil all that LSU versus SC scuffle situation down to SEC's tagline? It just means more. <laughs> no, I did not know that one. Okay, it just means more. Okay, I like that. It just means more. But low key, CC only stayed because Leah Boston got the number one pick in the 2023 draft. She wanted to be the number one spot. She's definitely the number one pick. Hmm. You think so? All about jazz? I thought that maybe she came back for another chance at, at a national title. I, I thought that's what she came back for. For another shot at that natty. To get that close and not get it done, I thought she came back for the natty. I believe uh, great offense can stymie even the best defense. On on a, on a on, on any given day, anybody can lose. But I, I'm going. I'm. Uh, I would. I'm going to lead with my defense. I'm going to try. I'm going to rest on my defense. I'm going. I'm going to come out first, confident that I can stop you. If I can stop you, then I can take my time figuring out how to get two, two, three points. As long as you don't get nothing. Uh, women have to do four years of graduate. She couldn't have declared last year. Who is? It? Oh, Caitlin. Oh, that's right. She's not no fifth year senior. This is. She's. This is her fourth year. Somebody on Twitter said, all you got to do is blow on UConn players' knees and they done for. They not lying. But what is that? What What is that? I, I, don't, I don't know. What, what is that? Shaking my head, Bree. <laughs> Come on, RC. 23 points in the second half. Who put her in a crock pot? I don't know. But she got the cooking, didn't she? She got the cooking. She like, not on my watch. This boy, Brad, say it's the shoes. Two point game. I did not see this coming, y'all. I gotta, I gotta admit, I thought we were just saying this is a snoozer. Now it might be down to the wire. So, but this is why we watch. Okay, so what do we agree on? Tennessee, UConn, Notre Dame. Probably can run some errands tomorrow around three. Won't nothing be going on. Yeah, no games on worth watching them. Somebody doing voodoo on UConn. <laughs> Last time Iowa lost, I spit was Ply's crock pot, and then I woke up from my dream. <laughs> what? Witchcraft over there? Oh no. Mm, mm, mm. I spit in his crock pot. RC, you are terrible. Yeah, I. Uh, I mean, even if they don't, because because they got back within two, I'm okay with with still watching because I didn't see this coming. So as long as they can keep it close to the end, I'll take that. Didn't 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 Nebraska beat Iowa? I think they did. Was that Nebraska to beat y'all uh, RC? They seem a little out of sorts, don't they? They, they like they they don't know what to do all of a sudden. Oh, they act like they knew that was going in. Y'all better block some box somebody out. Yeah, Nebraska throwing the ball away. Yeah, ain't nobody playing that three AIO. I'm gonna run some errands about three. About three tomorrow. You can run errands. One number you going on there. Ask me something with the strength and conditioning trainers. Because what yeah, is is Molly Bonetti the only one that knows what to do? Maybe it ain't the kids that need to go go see Molly. Maybe Molly needs to do a class for the trainers. Maybe you need a trainer that's certified by Molly. Molly needs to start giving out certifications, it seems like take care of these kids' bodies. Oh, that's right. They did. I remember us talking about that now. I had some I had some uh some of my medicine pre Wayne. I'm sorry. Uh let me see. Let's go, Aggies. No, I'm not a YouTube prisoner, but it ain't nothing going on tomorrow at three, RC worth being live for. It's nothing to be live for tomorrow at three, but 
noon, one o'clock, two fifteen. Yep. Later on, four thirty. But three o'clock looking wide open. Nebraska is losing it. <laughs> oh no, girl, you can't go down here and throw that at the back of the back, at the bottom of the backboard. Not when we're trying to tie it up. Now we need another stop. Come on. Come on. Nebraska and Iowa split. Okay. <laughs> Paige and AZ didn't even work with the UConn trainers when they got hurt. That should tell you something. Oh, wow. Everybody just doing their own thing. Oh, yeah. Come on. Yeah, get back to giving it to Koulibaly. Y'all don't want that to fall. Come on. Now, y'all been in within two forever. Come on. Do any, who not scared? Yeah. 3 p.m. games, nothing going on at 3. They bet, listen, and then they bet not lose. They bet not lose. Nebraska can't buy a bucket, and I don't know what Texas A&M doing. They need to start, they need to go back to, uh-oh, girl, that ain't it. Okay, well, then she drew the foul. Late whistle with the help. Still, still a two-point game, minute 38 left. Um... Iowa Holy Cross is at three, but nothing really, nothing really I see going on at three. Now, Syracuse and Arizona is on at 3.30, and NC State, Chattanooga start about 2.30, but three o'clock is wide open. Now you can see Iowa going home early. <laughs> and yeah, she ain't got shirts to say body by Benetti for no reason. If Benetti ain't give you a certificate, you can't be in business. I'm, hey, listen, body by Benetti, let's go. Hey, RC's team, no, nobody's on. Congratulations, Texas A&M. Tied it up. Okay. Texas, like, we ain't done yet. We play 40 minutes, too, because that's what we do in the SEC. Let's go. Okay. Fight then. Oh, it's five Koulibaly. They need to run everything through her. Is, is that Koulibaly, y'all? Yeah, they need to run everything through her. Tie game. I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad I stuck around for this one. Iowa too confident. Uh. Yeah, I mean. We know that they 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 um are favored. We know that we know that they want to see them in that in that uh, final four for sure. Yes. Uh oh. Oh, your game is behind. My bad. All about jazz. Rogers got a lock in. Yeah, I'm on the East Coast, so. Three Eastern, it's nothing going on. So, two Central, it's wide open. It's wide open is what I'm saying, RC. Two Central is wide open. You can run some errands if you got some bills to pay. Grab a few groceries. Two o'clock Central is a good time to do it, RC. Coach Taylor talking about come get the ball. How about give her the ball? <laughs> Iowa or the entire world. <laughs> I'm, I hope that I'm going to get to let you know that it's them. All about jazz. I hope I get to say that. Oh. Oh. They came back like, uh-oh, our magic powers fell off. And you just came down just all out of control, girl. Lost your head. Why did you do that? Why did you do that? See when them fundamentals come in the Fundamentals. There was no reason for you to even attack the basket like that, girl. 
Just pull out a setup. It's a tie game. Let's be sure. Oh, the decisions. The decisions. Y'all saw that? He didn't, he didn't beat the Texas A&M logo off that. <laughs> what? I missed it. Whoever. Oh, that is in the band. I didn't I didn't see the band. Coach Taylor is a bad B. Oh, man. Don't get me started. Now she clumsy. <laughs> now she clumsy. Iowa got hella fans. Yes, they do. Hello, it's funny how you asked her like she in front of you. Listen, I'm sorry. This had be sometime. This how this how be in front of the thing. You better make up for it. Now, nah, damn it, you done made two bad decisions. Okay, okay, that's what I said. Run the plate through. Damn. Goodness gracious. And now we could have been up by two. You out here doing all this foolishness. You know who to run the play for. Goodness gracious, girl. Why you shoot that? <sighs> okay, it's going to be an OT game. Okay. See, instead of letting them know, set up and run a play. Thank you. That's what I'm saying. Yes. Exactly. The, and the, oh, damn. She, she then her threw that girl down crazy. She, sl- she threw 14 on the ground. Y'all seen that? Nebraska needs to go to the tree. They could be headed there. What are we looking at here? Her throwing that girl down? Oh, okay, Texas A&M. Tell them how you really feel. Mm. It's a ball game now. Kulabali. Show them who you are. Texas, who are you? Man, ain't this exciting? Ain't this what we watch for? My goodness. Let's go. Jeez. She's so bad. Damn. Uh. So, what y'all think? Overtime? Cornhuskers win. The Koulibaly just sealed the game with the free throw. Can they pick up and defend 17 seconds? I wasn't expecting this either. No, Antonio, I did not remember. Me either. We are going to get a three. Okay. Koulibaly do be getting busy, though. It took me five days to get over the blood bath gauntlet that they issued us. I'm telling you, it takes me time. <laughs> RC, we here for you. We are here for you. This is exactly why we watch. Exactly why we watch. Yes. Oh, in the SEC tournament. Yes. I re- yeah, she gave us some work. Nebraska going to the tree. Okay, y'all calling me. I should might have sealed this game. Ain't she? Yeah, she knows she bad too. She she knows she bad, but it ain't a it ain't a it ain't a cocky uh no I no I'm bad type of thing. It's just a she wear it well, no she bad kind of thing. This the last game tonight. Yes, it is. Oh, Kiki knows she can't completely trust Lauren Betts to do the damn thing. You hope she knows that now. You want to make sure she knows that now, RC? Okay. Okay. Oh, okay. They blew it. Did Koulibaly pull this off?
Oh, yeah, definitely a confident no, she bad, for sure. She don't know why she fouled. The craziest ass play. What? 14.6. This is why we watch, y'all. Oh, Doc, you must be you must be ahead of me. Come on, Doc. Let me know that that's what it is. This should stay playing only super doc, duper hard. Let's go. I mean, is anybody gonna get the ball or what? Damn. Run the play through number five. Game winner coming. That's what I that's what I thought Doc was saying to us. Uh no. That's it. We're gonna hit the three. Plays in a row. It's number two to one that made them other two plays. Who gave her the green light? Have she been watching this game? It's been all about number five, ain't it? Yeah. Why? I guess Nebraska gonna look her they way out of here. Look like it. Nah, she ain't she ain't gonna pull it off. She gonna cool her ball. <laughs> oh my gosh. RC, come on, man. What? Yeah, why did you do that? That wasn't that wasn't the that wasn't it. That wasn't it. That's what I'm saying. Barker had no business with the ball. I don't understand what just happened. But let's see what they can figure out. Doc Glover, I don't know. I thought when you said Kula Bali that that was a game winner coming up. I thought you was ahead of me. I don't know why. I don't know why. But all about Jazz say we're going to hit that three and take it to overtime. So she's going to hit both of these and we're going to hit the three and go to overtime. This is why we watch. Shelly trying to win it. Let's see. 2.2. Oh, they got a dude on their sideline. I thought that was Kendrick Perkins at first. No, he don't look like Kendrick Perkins like that. He just leaned over. I thought that was KP at first. Point game. No. All about jazz. 1.4 seconds left. Two point game. <laughs> Say crazy ending loaded. You can feel it. Okay. Crazy ending loaded. This is why we watch y'all. <laughs> yeah, AIO. Just when I glanced at first, I was like, they look like Kendrick Perkins. And then, no, it wasn't Kendrick Perkins. But yeah, blue suit for sure. Navy.
She sold this game. Don't they? They need a wide open bank off the backboard. Huh. The three are winning for him. Yeah, 59-61. We rebounded and called timeout. Yeah, she missed that second one. They trying to pull off a Camilla. What you got? Nope. Couldn't pull it off. Couldn't pull off a Cardozo. No. That was a close one, but this is why we watch. Could not do it. No. Y'all, thank y'all for rocking with me tonight. I am back tomorrow, uh, 12 o'clock, Tennessee, 1 o'clock, uh, UConn, lunch at 3, and then back after that. But 12 o'clock. Y'all around, come hang out with me. I appreciate all the love. I appreciate y'all rocking with me all day. It's the begin Day one, y'all. Let's go. The Revenge Tour began. It's your favorite auntie with Uncle Tendencies. I'm going to get on out of here. Thank y'all. Much love. Until next time, stay tuned. Talk soon. I'm out. Good night.